I've had quite a history reviewing Nine Callisto's rap projects in the past. I've done them on my main channel, Master Jake Studios, uh, when he was kind of early on and kind of finding his own sound, kind of like kind of playing around a little bit. Obviously, at that point, he had plenty of room for improvement. However, as he went on, he impressed me with a lot more conceptuality in his lyrics. With Radical, I still was really impressed by the concepts he handled. I thought he had more confidence and like technical skill in his delivery and all of that is proved with this album here or mixtape rather Underworld where his technical ability is just through the roof but first off I want to establish what the style of music is it's not the same conceptual kind of self-reflective rap music that Nine Callisto offered on Radical it's kind of moving towards what Girl Talk sort of was but even more aggressive and angry and violent. This is extremely distorted, high energy, ridiculously over the top trap rap. And although sometimes it scratches the edge of being just too indulgent for its own good, I have to admit there were moments where I was just rolling my eyes at what was going on, especially during those rants at the end of the first track, Superiority Complex, where he's kind of going on this rant about how he's the best in the game right now. Probably is like part of his character, but it did kind of seem like an unnecessary move considering how great that track was before that rant. And, and also the final track on the tape features another rant that is just, again, very unnecessary, I thought. You know, it was best to let the music kind of speak for itself. You don't really need to kind of brag about how great you are if the music itself is kind of doing that for you. Superiority Complex includes some of his craziest flows yet. It is a very zany, fast-paced, high-energy, coked-up rap track where he's just going off. He's just popping. He's popping on that beat. Dance, 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 dance. Money over hoes all day. Smoke on dope, take push to the face with cocaine. Let's have a trip all day. And the beats on this mixtape are fantastic. I usually forget to credit the producers on the Nine Callisto Project review, but this time I'm not forgetting them. From Forza to Ugi Main to Perp Dog, um, they do a fantastic job presenting these grimy, abrasive, raw, primal beats that just fit Nine Callisto's rage-filled delivery. He raps with a lot more conviction. It shows on a track like All Day, which was off one of his earliest projects, Antisocial, but he re-records his verses, so he kind of has a bit more venom to his delivery. You can feel the desperation there, and which kind of fits because this is one of the more cold and moody tracks on the tape. Black Smurf does a great verse, and although All Day is one of the serious tracks on here, they don't feel too out of place on the tape. But on the serious tracks, he still manages to maintain that venom, that aggression, without kind of losing the flavor of the previous tracks that kind of made the mixtape such a buzz all the way through superiority complex trench town catch my body catch my body catch my body and drinking mud and, uh, and this is on a mixtape that has a song called your boyfriend is a bitch which i have to say was so fun and so hilarious that i actually ended up liking it anyways but i think one of the biggest lyrical highlights is um yeah. Boo -boo boogie man and forza on the beat on the click, click, click on hentai haven i'm a pain my meat oh. that that sounds like a line that could have been extremely cringy, but because it's delivered with such like bombast on such a high energy track, and Callisto's already established this tape is just meant to be so loose and unhinged, you kind of just take it. You kind of just go, yeah, yeah, that's what he does. He because at the end of the day, this is a very like fun mixtape. Like I actually enjoyed listening to it a whole lot. Of course, I said there were misses, but there are more hits than misses on this tape. And this is how you do like one of those fun rap tapes, one of those fun trap rap tapes without getting tedious or, or too vapid rather. He still displays a lot of substance, a lot of like really entertaining punchlines and, and a lot of great technical ability too. Let's not forget the technical ability. This isn't the first time Nine Callisto has dropped really angry trap rap songs like this, especially distorted ones. However, I was kind of worried that I wouldn't necessarily enjoy a full track listing or collection of these kinds of tracks. However, did it the absolute madman. Woo! I'm feeling like this mixtape deserves a strong 6 out of 10 to a light 7 out of 10. I'm, I'm enjoying this and I'm only hoping that Nine Callisto continues to flourish in this way. I'm not sure which direction he's going to go from here. Maybe he'll stick to this. Maybe he'll move on. I don't know. But whatever it is, I'm on board because he's shown that he can, he can, he can tackle whatever's thrown at him.